What a Survivor Series, ladies and gentlemen. It was a clean slate by Monday Night Raw. 6-0. Monday Night Raw was able to win. SmackDown did not win one match in the brand supremacy. The main event, which featured Brock Lesnar taking on Daniel Bryan, was one hell of a contest. Daniel Bryan was brutally assaulted in the beginning, taken straight to Suplex City, but was able to capitalize. He got the upper hand, got the low blow on Brock Lesnar, and then the match turned around. But in the end, Brock Brock Lesnar was able to get the victory. But one hell of a show. Also, we saw Ronda Rousey defeat Charlotte Flair by disqualification, which was one hell of a match, to say the least. It started out as a shoot. Charlotte Flair was basically exposing Ronda Rousey, showing her experience for the wrestling business. And later on, as Ronda Rousey was able to almost defeat Charlotte, Charlotte got a hand of a kendo stick attacking Ronda Rousey on the outside and breaking the candlestick straight over her. And then continued the assault inside the ring, leaving her battered and bruised, bleeding, and almost concussed. Ronda Rousey was in a fight, and you could tell from the end. It Sort of looked like she wanted to quit after tonight's match. Charlotte Flair taking the fight to Ronda Rousey. Showing her what this business is all about. Also, we saw Braun Strowman basically win the whole 5-on-5 match against the SmackDown team. Defeating all members of SmackDown except for Samoa Joe. But Samoa Joe was defeated in the early on from Drew McIntyre. But that was, I would have to say, match of the night. The 5-on-5 men's contest. Also, the Cruiserweight title. That was probably match of the night as well, as Buddy Murphy was able to to retain the title against Mustafa Ali. Also, we saw a brutal contest between two tag teams, Authors of Pain... And Cesaro and Sheamus, the bar. That was one hell of a contest, but the authors of pain were able to pick up the victory. Also, we saw Shinsuke Nakamura and Seth Rollins battle it out. Seth Rollins was able to get the victory, and it was a pretty good match, to say the least. And also, we saw Nia Jax pick up the victories for the 5-on-5 traditional Survivor Series match. Women's match. She was able to pick up the victory and win it for her team. And in the pre-show, we saw the Usos pick up the victory for their team in the 10-man tag team Survivor Series match. Traditional match. 10 tag teams from Raw and SmackDown. But that didn't count on the actual Survivor Series show. Monday Night Raw was a clean slate here tonight, 6-0, and and this pay-per-view, I gotta say, was pretty damn good, I mean, I might want to watch it again, it was that damn good. Alright guys, enjoy the rest of your night, be safe, and be well.